Good evening and welcome to Sports Federation TV. My name is Alton Davids. I'm your host. As you know, the show is about what makes sport happen within the Western Cape. We talk a range of different codes of sport. Sport is governed by the national body called SASCOC, under which there are 73 different codes of sport. Within the Western Cape, we practice most of them. One of those codes of sport is calisthenics. Simone, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Good, good. Mr. Barry, what's happening? Well, um, it's quite exciting stuff are happening all over the world right now. Um, as we know, we are having a calisthenics. Some people call it calisthenics, it's not, it's completely different. Um, what we basically do is body weight training. Um, we uh, also do quite a few fundraisers, which we're basically, basically having one this Saturday called World, like World Pull-Up Day. And what we're doing is trying to achieve this all over the world. Literally, the whole calisthenics community is coming together on exactly the same time and, play, and uh, on an outdoor facility. And we're basically doing a charity of your choice fundraiser as such. Cool. And yeah, it's beautiful. It's awesome. Simone, so take us through some of the concepts behind your sport. People don't, people have never heard of it. I certainly haven't heard of it <laughs> until a few weeks ago when I met you guys. Give us the background of, of how all of this came about and what's the aim of your, of your sport. Okay, calisthenics actually started way back in, in Greece where they were trying to build the strongest physiques. So yes, it uses a lot of um, it's strength training, but it's functional movements. So it's foundational for, for any sports. Um, anyone can do it. It, we start off with your basics, your planks, push-ups, dips, pull-ups, um, obviously building up to that. But yeah, it incorporates strength, flexibility, mobility, it's agility, it's endurance, it's stamina, it's creativity. That's where the street workout is kind of differentiates, mm. where you're able to bring something of yourself to it. But it's a good foundational sport for all other sports um, in terms of doesn't matter what you do, it, it will benefit every athlete. Okay, and, and, the, and the fun element is the, the street flexibility where guys can come and just do a, mm. a, a flip or whatever they want to choose. Do they do it to music or how does it work, Barry? Music, for sure, but you don't really need much. You okay. literally need an outdoor facility or your own pull-up rig, mm. which we call. We've got a name, our name's called Mavis. Uh -huh. Um, and then uh, you just bring what you have to give. It's okay. your interpretation of street workout. It's different than a rest guy. You can okay. have a gymnastics guy. You can have a guy doing rugby or cricket or whatever, and mm. he can do a funny kind of muscle up. And yep. that's your type of street workout. Okay. Taking guys off the streets is the most important thing. Mm. And I think that's what's so great about it is that your moves are, are standard. You've mm. got your, you know, your pull up, your front lever, your muscle up, your back lever. All of those, it's the same move, but everyone, it's what you bring to it, your creativity, your individuality, and that's what makes it such a, a fun and exciting, unique sport. And, and it's done all over Cape Town, or at, at certain areas? It's done wherever there's a park, wherever okay. there's an outdoor facility, wherever there's a bar. Um, people will find places, you don't even need a bar, you don't even need a park. You can be walking through a shopping center and on a lamppost, you see the guys <laughs> doing a, a flag or of the, the door of their car or something. It's, that's where the creative side gets, comes into it. For sure. it's, I think at the end of the day, it's um, how fearless you are <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> but also how much strength you have, because yeah. I mean, you, you basically work against your own body weight more than anything else. Yeah. Mm -hmm. that, that's, that's the most, that's the key point mm. about you using your own body. So you can have a guy, 130 kilos, needing to lose weight. And you and your friend, your friend could be a skinny guy, and yep. the other guy could be a muscle bound guy, but you guys can all train together. The one we have on the board saying basic, the other one intermediate in advance, yep. and you guys can do it together. This is basically from my experience of being in the fitness industry mm. for so many years, it's the only thing, we, the, let's call it the art, yes. where you can actually have a swimmer, a rugby player, a cricket player, a netball player, a hockey player, training together as a team but yet reap the results from the swimmer being more buoyant on the water. Mm. Staying there, the rugby player with his step off even better. And it's so much fun. B because it's a cross-pollination of activities which will benefit every code Absolutely. of sport, as you said, Simon. Absolutely. From youth, <coughs> straight through. Mm. Let's take a look at uh, a clip and see what this exciting sport is all about.
is Sports Federation TV. If you've just tuned in, you're missing an exciting part of our show. Not that the rest is not going to be exciting, but this is exciting because you're working against your own body weight. We're chatting calisthenics. Simone, I'm speechless just looking at the guy's body. He's got a six pack. When I'm all grown up, I'm going to be like him. I also want a six pack. <laughs> is that one of the, the principles of, of, your, of your code of sport, is to get everybody into tip top shape? I think that just comes with the territory. Okay. Um, I've done everything from, and I've competed in running, swimming, cycling, bodybuilding, dancing. I've done it all, and this has been the fastest I've ever res gone results or seen results. So, out of all the other sports, but he, from a from a sporting point of view, personal training, why why would you why would you say that? Well, as 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 a personal trainer myself, I mean. There's nothing more rewarding than you doing it on yourself, mm. by yourself. Um, if, if, you think, if you think you don't need special tools, yep. it's you. Mm. It's you. How do you judge a competition of that nature? What, what are the guidelines that the, that the judges use? I mean, there must be some kind of guidelines to determine a champ. How difficult is it to be a judge? It's quite, uh, quite complicated. Very demanding. Um, there's three different areas that they they judge you on. Mm -hmm. One is your strength, one is your mobility, and the other one is your um, dynamics, so the, the movement, the flow. Okay. So, so let's say everybody's doing a pull-up, is it based on your form and how long it takes you to do a pull-up or how, yes. how do they judge a pull-up? Uh, you can, there's a, the criteria is quite, quite big in mm -hmm. that sense of like it's called static, yep. dynamic and flow. Okay. So you, you would have a, a specialist checking perfectly is this guy really doing a pull up or is he actually shaky yes. or is it like oh it's effortless no problem mm. is he holding it which means it's more of a static hold yes then you get point system for that okay. you get a full point system mm. of 10 or okay and then it's that's about it. connecting yes so getting the flow and that's where the creativity okay. side mm. comes into it as well because like that guy was going from the from the crossbar doing flips onto the other yeah. bar yes. so all of that kind of adds up to his total score mm -hmm. yes and his movement dynamic but, and also his form. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. But I mean, you need to have proper core for, for this. More than <laughs> anything core. else. 110 <laughs> percent <Sure>. core. Pure. <laughs> <laughs> Let, let's shift focus. Tell us about your, your, your national champs. How well do we do at nationals as a Western Cape organization? Well, um, Stanley, the, one of our athletes, he won this year. Nice. So he won nationals and world champs. So world champs went, as well? Yes, so he wow. went through to Moscow to represent South Africa. And at the end of the year, he'll be going to Beijing to represent South Africa once again. For the Super World Cup. Super sure. World Cup. Mm. Sure. And he's preparing that with him on the, yes. with the six pack you want. <laughs> can, I, can I buy that six pack? <laughs> Start yeah. calisthenics, it comes quick. <laughs> mm. It's a good idea. So, how much training does one need to do to be at his level? Or how does it work? Yo. Lots of training every day. Um, and you, you, sorry, you, you need to have a, a different kind of hunger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, Stan, Stan is a really hard worker. Mm. Uh, healthy body, healthy mind. That's his belief. That's, okay. his, that's his truth of the mm. matter. Um, yeah, it's all those guys training with him. They're like a brotherhood, like, like a family. Okay. Even overseas, you know, the most beautiful part about it is um, I've, I've come from an athletic background and then it's individual yep. when you, you look at each other like, hey, I'm going to beat you. Mm. These guys are literally overseas having fun with each other. Hey, check this move out. Yeah. Yeah, like, yep. oh, you're quite cool with this. Why didn't you try this? For sure. Really beautiful community, beautiful family. Mm. It's unbelievable. It's beautiful. Okay. Let's take a look and see some more footage of this new and emerging sport that's going to take over South Africa. Check this out. Mm.
Sports Federation TV is what you're watching. We're chatting calisthenics, not calisthenics. That's a completely <laughs> different aspect, and we'll, we'll chat about that another day. Simon, this is an exciting sport, and it's taking Cape Town, Western Cape, South Africa by storm, do you think? Absolutely. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take an ad break. We'll be right back. Welcome to Factory Shops SA mobile app. This app helps you find your nearest factory shop so you can save money. Download for clever shopping and distance locations. Search or browse. See your nearest shop's trading hours, website or email them, phone them or navigate with GPS to the shop. It's so easy. Factory Shops SA mobile app is the first and only mobile app in South Africa that shows you where your factory shops are. Download now on iTunes or Google Play. Stay healthy today, manage your diet. Evox Advanced Nutrition considers this the number one priority. Evox 5XL mural placement has a fantastic balance of proteins and carbohydrates. The Evox Lean Pro Diet Shake helps you limit your calorie intake when looking to lose weight. Or Evox Rapid Recovery, perfect for exercise recovery. Eat well, stay healthy, live well, live Evox. Available at the leading pharmacy near you. Evox Advanced Nutrition is the official sports nutrition supplier to Western Province Rugby and the DHL Storms. Welcome back to Sports Federation TV. We're chatting calisthenics, a sport that is based on you working with your own body weight on a range of bars and a range of flexibility movements with or without music. Barry, what's happening this weekend? Give us a rundown. This weekend is very exciting all over the world. Um, it's called World Pull-Up Day. Now, World Pull-Up Day, the whole calisthenics uh, community is um, doing a fundraiser for charity of your choice. And then literally we're also trying to break the world record also for the most pull-ups. Um, not in South Africa, but globally. And then uh, uh, it's bringing like-minded people together, uh, helping the community give back. Uh, all shapes, all sizes, like you've seen in some of the, the videos that we, sh we yep. sh showed you guys with uh, 2014 with Baby Nicola, which we mm. help her. And then uh, also a walk with Brandon. Um, gymnastic guy got injured and uh, oh, it's it's just beautiful causes and stuff you know and it's getting guys to do pull-ups you know you, you get a guy bring a hundred bucks and you need to do a few pull-ups and it's just okay thank you bonus yeah let's have a look and see the footage of last year's world pull-up day check this out World Pull-Up Day happens this weekend. Where is it, Sima? We're at Eden on the Bay from half past nine till two o'clock. You can come through at any time. Come and make your donation and do a few pull-ups. So there's no, there's no set fee. It's however much whatever you want to you donate. Want, yeah, as much as you're prepared to, to give. And then, yeah, come and help us set a world record. 
Th- will my name be in the Guinness World Book of Records? Or, or is it just <laughs> Cape Town pull-up p- crew? I think it'll just be the number of, oh. of pull-ups. <laughs> <laughs> but it's for a good cause anyway. Yeah. But we're also having a competition for who can do the most um, pull-ups, guys and girls. So. Okay. So ladies also do this? So absolutely. Tell me about some of the ladies. Um, at the moment, we are just trying to get more ladies in because ladies tend to look at it and say, oh, it's a, it's a male sport, but it's not at all. Where the guys might um, favor in the strength, the women have the, str- the flexibility. So as I say, it's what you bring to it. It's your mm. creativity. So we're on equal footing. <laughs> um, and yeah, from a purely aesthetic point of view, um, it's great for, for women because... Mm. Um, it gives you that long, lean muscle as opposed to, you know, women tend to be scared with the weight that they're going to bulk up. Yes. And, um, and I mean, I did when I was doing the bodybuilding, yes. you know, retain a lot of water. So from, as I say, an aesthetic point of view, um, it's great for the ladies as well. But yeah, strength, power, everything. It's, it's a, it makes you really strong. And you can do this anywhere, as you said earlier. You don't have to come. It's nice to come to Eden on the Bay and be part of the world record attempt. Mm-hmm. But you can do this in the park in your, in your area. Absolutely. And that's the upside of your sport. Mm-hmm. Anytime, any place, anywhere. For sure. In closing, contact details, website, email address, Facebook. Give us the lowdown. Either of you. You can find us on Facebook. Um, we're urbancull.co.za. Um, Facebook. We're Twitter, on Instagram, Instagram. Twitter. Um, yeah, it's all urbancull. So, yeah, look, look us up. Good. All the best for Saturday. I hope the weather holds for you. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. you. We need it. (laughs) Thanks for coming into the studio. Thank Thank you very much. Let's take an ad break. When we come back, we'll be chatting basketball. See you now.